Hi everybody, Chief Andrew Smith here, Green Bay Police Department. Today is Wednesday, May 20th. It's about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. It is 72 degrees out here in Green Bay. Absolutely gorgeous day. Um, if you haven't had a chance to get outside, those of you who are lifelong Green Bay residents like Kevin Rice, get outside today. Spend some time out there and enjoy yourself out there. Here's your numbers for you. 12,885 positive COVID tests in the state of Wisconsin as of today. 2,118 positive tests here in Brown County. Still got an issue here. And we've had 30 deaths here in Brown County, which is a lot higher than almost all the other counties in Wisconsin. So we still have issues in Wisconsin. We still have issues, especially here in Brown County. Let's be smart about this. If you need to get tested or if you're interested in getting tested, you don't need to have an appointment even. You should, but if you don't have one, that's okay. Right behind me, Casa Alba Melanie, they're testing people. I went over there earlier this morning. There were two people in line. Uh, they say it's very slow today. Um, they'll be here for a couple more days and then they're going to shut down. So if you want to get tested, you're here in Brown County, come on down, get tested here or at the Resch Center. Free of charge, relatively painless, takes a couple minutes. Very easy. As I said, we still have issues here in Wisconsin. We're asking people for voluntary compliance. Want to make sure we're keeping that social distance. Look, no cops are going to be writing tickets for anybody. We're not going to be chasing people out of bars or restaurants or anything like that. Um, we want people to enjoy themselves, but we got to be smart about it. We still have a lot of issues here in our town and in our, in our county, so we're asking for voluntary compliance. Wear the mask. You see me wearing a mask all the time. Um, you know, social distance, small groups, that type of thing. Let's just be smart about it. We can handle it. Um, want to take a minute, if you haven't checked our website today, Northern Chill Water came through today and gave us about 20 cases of Northern Chill Water, my new favorite bottled water. It's fantastic. Um, we want to say thanks to them. They were a lot of fun. We introduced them to our, one of our canines and we had a really, really great time with them. And they're going around the state giving water to hospitals, first responders, fire stations, police departments, things of that nature. So thanks to them. One concern I have here in Green Bay, I haven't mentioned it, is a couple of shootings we had over the weekend. Um, nobody was hit and we're not sure who was being shot or who was being shot at, uh, but we're really interested in stopping this. You know, anytime someone's pulling a trigger on a gun in Green Bay here, it's a huge concern for me. We had two incidents this weekend. Uh, one was just a single gunshot through a house. The other was a shooting that looked to be maybe back and forth between two individuals. A car was hit, a house was hit. As far as we know, nobody was hit. If you have any information on any of those, get with our detectives, give them a call. You can be anonymous if you want to go to Crime Stoppers, but we need your help to stop these things from happening because they only escalate and only results in somebody getting hurt sooner or later. So please help us out Wisconsin, help us out Green Bay. Let's stop these shootings before they get out of hand, before anything bad happens. Again, 72 degrees out, things are going great here in Green Bay, 100% staffing at the police department. We're here for you if you need us. Give us a call if something goes wrong and give us a call if you know anything about those shootings. Meanwhile, we got this Green Bay.